We're going to rescue our economy. We're going to save our economy. We had the greatest economy in the history of our country. There was never a greater economy, and now we don't. And when you look at what's happened with inflation, inflation is destroying. You know, they call it a country killer. Going back hundreds of years, Germany, countries that had big inflation are dead. They become dead countries. We have to stop that immediately. And we want peace through strength. Russia would have never attacked Ukraine, would have never done it. Putin and I get along fine. We get along very well. That's a good thing, not a bad thing. The fake news, which I would, if the fake news would become real and honest news, 90% of our problems in this country would be solved. They would be solved. So, Russia would have never attacked. Israel would have never been attacked. The Ukraine situation is so horrible. The Israeli situation is so horrible. What's happened? And uh, we're going to get them solved. We're going to get them solved very fast. I actually said Ukraine. I know President Putin very well. I know Zelensky very well. I'm going to get them in. We're going to get it solved very quickly. Should have never happened. Would have never happened. Now you have all that death, far greater than people understand. The numbers are far, far greater than anybody would even think possible. You're going to find that out in the years to come. When they knock down these massive buildings in Ukraine, and then you see uh, they announced two people were slightly wounded. No, no. Many people were killed. Many people were killed. We're going to get it stopped. But it's so sad because it should have never started. People killed and a culture destroyed. You can never replace thousand-year-old buildings with the most beautiful golden domes and churches and everything, just all rubble now. And it's so sad. Would have never, ever happened. And likewise, uh, Israel would have never been attacked.